Hi YouTube. So, um, my new idea in life is to make movie ideas. I always wonder how people come up with these movie ideas and great ideas because it's, you know, it's just weird. Like, how do they get it? So, I'm going to give my ideas on movies. Um, I'm going to send them out to the world and then maybe somebody who's a producer or, or a, you know, the whatever his name is, Mr. Steven Spielberg and uh, those type of guys, they could make movies, or Quentin Tarantino, yes. They could make movies about this stuff. As a matter of fact, I used to live next door to that guy on Hollywood Hills. I won't, I won't say where, but who knows. Okay, anyway, um, they could make movies about this stuff, and maybe they'll get this idea, and then they'll realize Sam Groft had that idea, and they'll pay their homage, you know, like they'll, they'll, they'll like say, okay, because I always feel like my ideas are, are, are out there, but anyway, how about this movie idea? This is a movie idea, so it's creative uh, idea only, um, just a creative movie idea, okay? So what if there was this place, right? It's, we call it planet Earth. It's kind of like where we live, and there was an alien invasion somehow that we were unaware of. And they captured all the presidents, all the world leaders, all the all the people, and they killed them. They just they got rid of them. They ate them. I don't know. They're aliens. So they ate them. They killed them. And then they designed this computerized system with holographic images and everything else, right? And they put this system in place. So... Everybody's controlled by these powers that be, but they're really controlled by computers. These are holograms. They're not real leaders. There's nobody that's really there. Everybody thinks they have to answer to somebody, but they can never get a hold of the person they're, they're talking to because they're doing automated systems, phones, television, videos. And you think about it, like in the movie, they trick the people with these images of people that seem real. They look real. Everything would be on like a, a platform of like Zoom, but it'll be something else. So everybody's answering to somebody that's not even real. It's a computer and it's being run by somebody else who's manipulating the images. That would be a great movie. And then the people found out because of this YouTube guy that puts his movie ideas out in the public. And so the public could see this and then they're like, Oh my God, the YouTube guy figured it out. See, now that would be a great, great first movie idea. I have many more ideas, um, but it would be a, a wonderful idea. And then in the movie, the way they found out, um, the people that were the, that you could actually see in person, that were the so-called leaders that had to answer to somebody or someone else, they started to do their homework and realize, you're right, I never can talk to that person. You're right, I never can talk to that person. And there was such a line of confusion that one day they stopped in their tracks. They said, we're not going to listen to this. We're not going to do it. We're going to do what we feel is right. Since these guys don't want to come to us in person and tell us this stuff, we're not going to follow the orders over a phone anymore, over a television, over none of that. So Mr. Steven Spielberg, Mr. Quentin Tarantino, great producers out there, if I haven't mentioned your name, this is my first movie idea. I've had many of them, but I've kept them in my head. I'm going to start giving them out to the world now. So make that movie, and if any of you guys know how to get in contact with them, you can send them this movie idea, because all the other obstacles in Hollywood are just too much. I don't know. I'm going to write those scripts and shit. I don't want to do all that, but... You, you, there's an idea for a, for a movie idea. I haven't seen a movie like that before. So, I mean, anyways, um, it kind of feels like we're living in that. <laughs> anyway, that would be wonderful. I, I would like to see this uh, get out there. So, go ahead, YouTube fans. Get you your contacts and put that idea out there and say, let's find this Sam Brown. He's got lots more ideas. Thank you. Today is my birthday, 10 15, 1980. I'm 41, and I read a book called Think and Grow Rich, Napoleon Hill. Great book. I recommend that book to anybody. Thank you very much.